Prince here, live and direct from Brooklyn, New York. And in front of me today, actually before I do what I'm gonna do when I do what I do, I just want to mention that I'm doing another giveaway this summer. Uh, please look under the video for how to qualify. Uh, in front of me today, boom, I have this puppy right here. I have a box of 2003-2004 SP Authentic. It is sick. Uh, Flowers Rookie Year. And I don't know, man, it could bring me to tears, Flowers Rookie Year. Uh, configuration five cards per pack, 24 packs per box, 120 cards total. Expect one future watch auto and expect one sign of the times. I love the low end sign of the times. I have some in the background as you can see. Base set runs one through 90. Then you have 45 future watches, 23 signed future watch rookie cards. Uh, there are patches as well, uh, something worth uh, noting. I believe the patches actually are not numbered cards, they're uh, lettered cards. Uh, and there are parallels, there's all kinds of parallels within this uh, puppy. One thing I wanted to mention, uh, besides the Sign of the Times, which are 1 in 26, and so that would be a 92% chance of those, there are duels and there are trips, but there are also special cut autos which are one one and the reason why I mention this, because uh, it kind of sort of blows my mind, is there's actually a super rare one of one Turk Broda card. Uh, his auto is one of the rarest ones in the hobby. Uh, and as well as some other really cool ones like Art Ross, uh, Harry Lumley I believe is in those one of ones uh, Of course you can't hit them because they're one of ones but they're kind of an interesting chase card nonetheless. With regard to the rookie class, there is Antoine Vermette, there's Chris Higgins, Dustin Brown, Eric Stahl, Joffrey Lupo, Jordan Tutu, M.A. Fleury, as I mentioned, Matt Stajan. There is Patrice Bergeron, a couple of others. I believe the Ryan Kessler would be a base uh, future watch. Sans auto, but we shall see. Let's pop this puppy into formation submission. Uh, here we go, guys. And there would be a little seal to peel. Boom. And let's get crackling, guys. So here would be our box. I'm gonna try to back this puppy up a bit. Nice, right? And I believe we have a checklist right on the top. So here would be our checklist. It's a papery checklist. We see our future watches, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, and yeah, man, let's get rolling with these. There should be some parallels, so that'd be something we should uh, be somewhat sig significantly aware of. Significantly, we should be aware of. There's Alexi Yashin, whose auto I have in the background there. Look at these, these are really hard uh, to differentiate. I think they're in different, um, some are upside down and some aren't, so it'll be sort of hard to figure out what's going on with these. Let's go, so there's Vinny Donfus, and there's Rick DiPietro. Uh, I believe these are all base cards. And this is what the back of the cards look like. Kind of dated, aren't they? Still pretty nice looking cards. There's Habi Bulin, uh, Jason Spezza, Roman Chechmanek. We have a Sergei Samsonov, as well as a Chris Oscar, again, who I have in the background. You could perhaps uh, see his auto back there. Boom. People are yelling outside again in Brooklyn, New York, which is not uncommon. It's par for the course. There's Marty Turco. There's Jiggy. And there's Mike Dunham. Marion Gabrick. As well as Peter Forsberg. I believe all these are base. Uh, I shall sort of rummage through them at the end of the break before the recap to uh, see if I missed anything crucial. Man, loads of goalie mojo per usual uh, for your humble narrator. There's Shawnee Burke. Uh, there's Greg Campbell. And this Greg Campbell, I believe, is a base future watch, unless I'm mistaken. Which actually is one of the better ones. That list of base future watches is really paltry. I'll put that one aside, Hemsky. There's Marty Biron, who's an announcer now. Campbell was a 67th overall, and he did play on the Bruins. I believe he played on the Stanley Cup winning team of the Bruins. Did Greg Campbell. He is one of the better uh, base future watches in this particular bunch. He was a center, I believe. Uh, there's Tommy Salo. There's Jamie Storer. There's some old school. There's Todd Bertuzzi. Chris Drury and Dougie Waite. Wait, I'm just 
taking a peek really quickly, see if I missed anything. Nope, I think all these are kosher. Okay. Let's see, oh, we have, oh, is that a redemption? That is not good news if that is a redemption. Uh, I'm worried. Let's see. Ziggy Palfi. Joe Sackick. Is that a, well, let's see. There's Marion Hosa. Well, let's see, is that a redemption? It's a totally a redemption, guys. This is disastrous. Let's see what we have here. I'm gonna zoom in, because it's really, uh, it's really gray. Okay, so this is a sign of the times, which is my favorite. It's a triple auto, guys. The triple auto checklist is insane. I can't believe, I'm, I'm in a lot of pain here. Do you guys see that? That says Wayne Gretzky. This is the best. This is the best hit I've hit in my entire life, and I and it's a it's an expired redemption. Jason Spezza, Wayne Gretzky. This is this is just ridiculous. Who's the other one? It's Joe Thor. Are, can you guys see that? Uh, uh. This is like a what is it? A $500 card or something? Can you guys see this? Um, this is unbelievable. This is unbelievable. I hit a I hit a Wayne Gretzky, Joe Thornton, Jason Spezza. I, I, I can if I can find the card online. But what's what's the numbering on this? It's got to be totally like 25. I'm, let me. I'm just gonna check it. Look it up really quickly if I can. Uh, sign of the time triple autos are, are numbered to 25. So this was a number to 25 Gretzky triple autograph. I have to, maybe I can call, I'm having a bit of a meltdown here. I'm gonna be, this is gonna take me a minute guys. <laughs> uh, I can't believe that just happened. I, I finally hit the hit of my life. I mean, I have hit a McDavid auto, but this is just, oh. Moving on, um, I'm shaking. I feel really hot. <laughs> David Leguan, the hit of my life. Another Wayne Gretzky numbered card. Oh, this is the SP, oh, that's cool. You know what this is? This is a Wayne Gretzky box is what it is. This is an original SP from 1993 uh, retro and it's numbered to 1994. They may have parallels of these actually, numbered to less, like 99, but this that, that's the old emblem. So this is a Gretzky numbered to 1994. Oh, that's cool, look at the back. Oh, I can't believe that just happened. I'm gonna have to, maybe they can, maybe they can take pity on me. You know, because these boxes cost over a hundred American, usually in the hundred and thirty-five dollar range. American, you can maybe get them for one hundred and fifteen or one hundred and twenty. Uh, there's McGillney, by the way. Patrick Laleem, Paul Korea. I'm, I'm on another plane right now. I'm, I'm not even present with you guys right now. My my mind is elsewhere. There's Marc Messier. I mean, these cards are great. There's Bobby Lou, Rick Nash. Uh, I mean, if I can hit a flower or a Patrice Bergeron, we'll maybe atone for that, but that was the hit of my life and it's completely useless. <laughs> uh, there's Joe Thornton. There's Jumbo Joe, first overall in 1997. Eddie Belfour, Manny Fernandez, tons of goalies in here. Todd Marchand, the, the heater. Um, having a bit of a meltdown, but anyways, I think there's something here. This is, this is a hit, guys. Uh, there's Thomas Vokun. Oh, this is one of those, uh, they're actually kind of interesting cards. Mike Johnson, I can't remember what they're called. There's Dominator. Loads of goalies in here, so this might be okay, so. Give me, give me something crazy. So these honors have like Gordy Howe and stuff like that. Oh, look at this! See, it's the uh, Mario Lemieux honors. 
Number to 900, which means it's not a parallel. I believe they do have parallels for all of these puppies, but I'm not sure. Yeah, the, all the parallels for the honors and the 10th anniversaries are number to 99, so those are base. Ron Francis, Jason King, Scott Stevens, Mike Medano, and the Iggy, the Iggy Meister. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm cussing and cursing. Rafi Torres, I think that's another one of those honors. There's Yair Jagger, Mike Johnson. Uh, okay, and this one would have, oh, look at this, it's a Scotty Bowman, that's nice. Wow, number two, 900. I'm absolutely, you know, I never hit a Gretzky. This was my first Gretzky in terms of autos. I've been doing this hobby. I mean, I hit his rookie card back when I was a kid, aging myself a bit. There's Zetterberg. There's Jocelyn Tebow, who I believe was a 10th overall. There's Owen Nolan. Uh, one of the most memorable all-star moments. I love Babe Ruth calling his own uh, goal top corner. Peter Bondra, Scott Stevens, Mike Medano, and Iggy again. Uh, based on the fact that, oh, there's a car making all kinds of racket. Uh, I think we should collect, what, almost the entire base set. Marcus Nasland, Jeremy Roenick, there's Mario, Patrick Eliash, and Stevie Y. Considering there's 120 cards uh, in the box and 90 cards uh, base checklist, we should actually uh, receive the entire uh, base set uh, if everything goes as planned with duplicates like this Tebow and this uh, Owen Nolan. There's Jeff Hackett, who also played on the Habs. Speaking of which, there's Saku Koivu and there's Nabokov. Uh, if I hit parallels, guys, um, sorry, my mind is on another planet right now. I can't believe I hit that card and I can't believe it was a redemption. Had it not been a redemption. Oh, look at this. We had Scott Gomez and SP Limited. So this is Scotty Gomez, an ex-Hab, uh, notoriously involved. I believe he and Gianta were traded around the time uh, we lost McDonough, who they were concerned about because of a, uh, a leg injury at the time. But this is a limited. So this is actually a parallel of Scotty Gomez, number to 99, 19 of 99. So that's kind of cool. Uh, there's another Mario, Eliash, Stevie Y. We still haven't hit our Future Watch Auto, so we are guaranteed that, uh, which is nice. There's Ronnie Francis, who some Goomba is honking outside. And the reason why he's honking is uh, the day when they clean the streets, you end up with double parking on one side of the street uh, just so that they clean the streets. And then sometimes people on the inside want to get back into their car. And they do this during uh, an epic break when, where I hit a Wayne Gretzky. Patty Marlowe, Marcel Hosa, Pierre-Marc Bouchard, Marc Denis, and Sergei Fedorov. So what do you think, guys? Which one of these? Marty Brodeur, Adam Oates. Oh, here's our auto. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh my God, this box is unbelievable. This box is ridiculous. No way. Oh man, he was what, a 45th overall was Patrice Bergeron? Wow. That's nice, I mean. <laughs> Can you believe this box, guys? Uh, oh my God, I'm gonna, I'm losing my mind. There's your all, man. I mean, 1,028 games played in the NHL. He's got 321 goals. He's got 813 points. He's the man with the master plan. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, <laughs> I would have preferred Flurry, as you know, 
But right now, um, beggars can't be choosers, apparently, within this box. What a box. Did I pick the right box or what, guys? Oh, man. Or the wrong one, depending on how you look at it. And this is another, this is a Phil Oser. Um, just a base future watch. As I said, this list is a little bit paltry, so you get this cap out of Worcester. Ah, Mark Denis again, Sergei Fedorov. <laughs> There's only one future watch auto, and I hit the pass with Patrice Bergeron, so there you go, guys. Uh, what a box. What an unbelievable box. So this is one of those, uh, another one, oh, that's an Alice Hemsky, uh, 10 year edition anniversary cards. Ah, Vinny Le Cavalier, Eric Lindros. I'm sighing, I've been sighing the entire video, guys. Just one major, elongated, endless sigh. There's Bill Guerin, Kovalchuk, there's Jose Theodore, Abisher, and Christoph. So that's it, guys. I mean, yeah. Wowzer. Time for the recap. Okay guys, time for the recap. So my brain is somewhat hemorrhaging from that break. <laughs> Nonetheless, uh, with regard to the base set, man, we received the entire base set, which is cool schools, including this cool one of Jiggy, uh, Stanley Cup and Consumite Trophy winner Jiggy. We also received sets of all 90 cards of the base set, plus we received an extra bonus 20 cards of base. Uh, we did receive a couple of the base future watches. These, this checklist is a little bit delimited, if you will. It's not the best checklist. We did receive this cat goaltender because I always have my goalie mojo, as well as Greg Campbell, who I believe is Colin Campbell's uh, son. He was on your Stanley Cup champion Bruins, if I recall correctly, and I recollect correctly. We did receive two of these SP honors, including Mario number to 900. He is second all-time in points per game at 1.88, behind Gretzky's 1.92. We did also receive the Scotty Bowman, who has 14 cups, including his front office work. He almost had more, uh, had he won with St. Louis in his uh, initial years in the league. Uh, what else did we receive? We received a couple of these cats here, which are these retro 10th anniversary cards. Uh, and we received the Wayne Gretzky, number to 1999, as well as Alice Hemsky. So these would be our two commemorative 10th year anniversary cards with the old school uh, 1993 emblem there. Uh, we also received a Scotty Gomez parallel. So here's a Scotty Gomez parallel, number 299. It is 19 of 99, so this is a limited parallel, I believe is what they call it, SP Limited. And finally, I'm rubbing my temples right now. I'm rubbing both my temples uh, with both my hands. Uh, I received this redemption, uh, expired in 2007, of a triple auto sign of the times. Everybody knows that sign of the times are my favorite autos. Um, and it's a Spezza, Joe Thornton, Wayne Gretzky. Uh, I can call them, I guess. This is enormous. It's number to 25, I believe, because I believe all the triples are number to 25. So that, and if you're wondering who my future watch uh, auto was, look at that. This is what's going on today. <laughs> up in my domicile, up in my hood. Uh, it's a beautiful, absolutely spectacularly perfect auto. Uh, 463 of 900. Uh, this, is, I guarantee you, is a $150 card plus. Uh, this here has got to be over $300. And I never think and talk about money for cards because for me, I, I love every single card. But it's just so rare for me to hit a box, a retro box, with this kind of mojo. It defies the odds. I, I would tell you what the odds are, but the odds are astronomical for that to have happened. Um, and then for them to be no good. Um, yeah. So has anybody ever called for an expired redemption for a Gretzky or a Howe uh, and tried to get something out of Upper Deck? Because usually they just say, I guess you can do the raffle or whatnot. Anyways, guys, please look under the video if you want to qualify for my giveaway. I do give away cards. I am that guy. I am that cat. I'm old school. Uh, just bring love to the hobby. <laughs> what a box. I'm Fulton Cards. Please subscribe. Please provide a like. Please comment. Please enter the giveaway. Uh, Full Cards Live and Direct from Brooklyn, New York. Didn't I give you